I would say the one time that I can recall um, almost giving up on God was back early in my Christian life when I thought the Bible was promising me something that it was not promising. It was because of certain books that I had read in which these writers said uh, from Romans chapter 6, if you just reckon yourself dead to sin, you'll no longer experience temptation. Well, I tried that and it just didn't work. And, um, you know, I'd reckon myself dead to sin and then I'd have an awful day or something. And uh, one night I opened my Bible. And this sounds kind of funny, but I thought, I'm going to see if Romans 6, 11 is still in the Bible. I mean, that's, I was to that end. There it is. Reckon yourself dead indeed unto sin. Now, I misunderstood what Paul was saying there. But based on my misunderstanding, the thought came into my mind, it isn't true, is it? And I said, no, it isn't. Then I, I'm sure that this was of the devil. How do you know that John 3.16 is true? How do you know that anything in the Bible is true? If that's not true, then how do you know that anything is true? And I got down on my knees before God and I said, God, whatever happens, don't let me lose my faith. That's the closest, that's as close as I've come, that's as close as I'd ever want to come. Shortly after that, the Lord enabled me to see that these books that I'd been reading were promising something that Paul had not promised.